It's your boy, Mr. Hanky, producer of Smile, uh, living my best life, uh, California on the way, all those feel good records and all that, man. You tune in to 1079. Uh, this gonna sound real arrogant, but I knew when I did the beat in 2016 that whoever got it and did it right was gonna be, you know, it's gonna be a smash. Cause it just felt good, you know, the beat by itself, you could just play it and it just dance and then he put his magic on top of it and it's out of here. But right when right when Snoop sent his his verse and his his part on the hook, I knew then. Like it was like this gonna be crazy. Yeah, I knew it was go you know, it went from being a, you know, it's gonna be good on the internet for a minute, on Instagram for a minute, to it's gonna be like big in real life <laughs> for a minute. <laughs> Um, well, you know, I played in a band in high school and in college, um, played piano and all that good stuff. So, you know, I know, you know, pretty much what feels good, you know, that type of thing. But it just comes from really just going out and seeing, you know, what people haven't heard in a while or, you know, a vibe that'll be good that, you know, kind of change up what's going on. Oh, yeah, man, everybody, everybody calling from, um, you know, I got a record coming out with uh, Tory Lanez and Jacquees. Um, it's coming out real soon. Um, man, as far as even like the, you know, the Chris Browns of the world and all those people. So literally, man, I'm emailing stuff every five minutes. Seems like I just sent an email off right now. Yeah. I mean, you know, it is on top of the world, man. You know, and, and you know, like the, self, the saying goes, you know, next level, new devils type. You know, there's always some type of issue, you know, some type of um, controversy, not even that. It just you know, it's always some type of thing, but that some type of process. But that's what makes it dope, you know. At the end of the day, because we all growing from it and everything. So, yeah, it's it's crazy, man. You got a lot of people in your ear. Like you need to be doing this. You need to be doing that. Oh man, if I was you, I'd be doing this. I'd be doing that. So, you got to just. That's the biggest part of it. Learning what to you know listen into and what to kind of be like. Okay, cool. I like, got it. But yeah, it's a it's it's a, it's a great feeling. It's an amazing feeling. Yeah, definitely. I mean, you know, we still you know, take you know everybody's moving around and stuff now. But you know, most of relationships now is through email and text messages and you know, real brief conversations. But yeah, prior to this song, you had the um, you know a lot of the earlier Soldier Boy stuff with him and Gucci Man and Yo Gotti. Then uh, um, a lot of stuff with Soldier Boy, Nicki Minaj, Chingy. Um, then that came out with the walk around the club, fuck everybody song. That was crazy. Then after that, it was Smart Girl, Dumb Booty. And after that, it was the California record with Young Dolph, Colonel Lau, Rico Barino, and T.I. Uh, that was huge. Then after that, the On The Way record with Luke Nasty, which was huge too. So, you know, there's a bunch of stuff I'm missing, but that's a, a you know, a short version. I'm much different than a lot of producers I'm not you know I see a lot of people you know that's cool they just you know sit down and, and get keys out there and try to figure it out uh, me I'm a little bit different I already know what I want to do you know what I'm saying so it's most of the time like you know it's just music constantly going in my head you know so when I get down there I'm literally just putting down what I got in my head already so um, even on the sample side of stuff, I already know how I'm going to sample it, this and that third, even if it's a non-sample, I know how I'm going to do it. So, you know, I basically start off, a lot of times I start off with the music part of it, because um, the drums is cool, and then, you know, but the music got to be there. It got to be, have some kind of musical, something in it that catches people's ear. That makes it, everything that much easier, you know what I'm saying? So. I start off with the music side, make sure that's tight, the bass lines and all that good stuff. I come in with some hard drums on top of it. And a lot of people don't know, a lot of times um, I'm in there with the artist telling them how to come off on the record, like really produce it. Not just sending emails or just sending beats. Like I'm literally, we sitting down there, bouncing ideas back and forth, putting the whole record together. Yeah. So that's why they come out the way they do. Yeah. I'm um, really, you know, I'm looking forward to working with people like Chris Brown, Drake, uh, Beyonce, Jay Z, all the, you know, all the quarter, you know, the big dogs. Um, but even, you know, the Katy Perry's, you know, all that kind of stuff. 
it's nothing I really just don't like. And, you know, even the bad, the things that people think are bad, like, you know, some of the gentrification and all that that's going on, some of it is really not bad. You know what I'm saying? Some parts really did need to be upgraded. You know, um, you know, like everything that's going on the west side, you know, driving down Hollowell sometimes, it just, you know, some parts like a bomb went off over there. You know what I'm saying? <laughs> and it's cool, but, you know, you know, with change comes, you know, you got to give a little to get some. So, yeah, but me personally, I think it's cool. I think it's cool.